Welcome back. After more than four decades, tomorrow night will be the last night that Pat Sajak hosts the Wheel of Fortune. He first took over the wheel in 1981, winning three Emmy Awards in the hearts of millions of Americans. And as he wraps up his 41st and last season, we caught up with some former local contestants. News 10's Aaron Bowling shares their experience of playing the wheel alongside Sajak. Here are the stars of America's game. Sajak and Man of Across thousands of episodes, Pat Sajak guided thousands of people through the Wheel of Fortune. I was very nervous during the taping. He, he knew this, he could sense it, well, the whole audience could sense it, <laughs> but uh, he put everyone at ease. Paul Onan from Bath Township was a contestant in 2006. He remembers Sajak for his great comedic timing and down-to-earth nature. He's a pro. I mean, he'd already been hosting it for, what, 20, 20 years at least. I think he would be a great person to just uh, have dinner with. Raymond Herrick, a Williamston teacher who won the show in 2007, says Sajak was witty and professional. I think he set a precedent of it's not about me, it's about contestants having fun and really facilitating that and making sure that the contestants around the show have the best time that they possibly can. Debbie Jordan, a Brooklyn native, now retired in Florida, competed in 2002. She says talking with him was just like talking with your buddy. He let Jordan sing a short tune on the show, given her background in singing telegrams. Pat, happy retirement, and if you ever would like a singing telegram delivered to you or one of your friends, you just call me and I will hook you up. Sending congrats and praises. You've done a great job and you've certainly earned your, your time off for sure. He's like the biggest legend in game show history and... They can't possibly match the combination of uh, Pat and Vanna. Aaron Bowling reporting, News 10.